I don't know if this is out yet, but uh, I'm glad it's happening because this motherfucker been coaching basketball as long as people been alive, and he miserable as fuck. Uh, they do not know a Syracuse basketball years. It's utterly a shock to everyone. Breaking news, but I'm now in Syracuse. Comes out, was he in the loop? Was he aware? Those are the kinds of questions. But you think the he wanted to come back or not. So there are some questions and uncertainty of this. Did he know leading up to it? You think the press conference was only an hour or two ago. Now this news comes out. Was he in the loop? Was he aware? Those are the kinds of questions that people want to know. But truly, it's utterly a shock to everyone who was up here that that moment and that day finally arrived. You think 47 years, that is such a long time where a lot of the fans and the students up here who I'm seeing who are coming from class or whatnot, they do not know a Syracuse basketball program where Jim Beheim is not a part of it. It has never happened for them. They have not seen it. In my lifetime, I don't know of one. In my lifetime, for right? as many years as I have been walking or crawling the earth, uh, yeah, and, and, that's, and that's really... I that's knew it. Where we need to put some focus. Uh, on that, that extraordinary I told my boy the other day I was like man that motherfucking dude is miserable as fuck bro He's stepping down Everybody's like no he's gonna go for 50 years I'm like bro that dude's stepping down Get back with you at 6 o'clock on the breaking news Thank you Wow Syracuse city officials are proposing a new program